Hi, I'm Samantha Taylor with SP Gymnastics. Samantha, this week uh, your team heads to Bridgeport, Connecticut, long cross-country trip for the USAG Collegiate Championships. Your thoughts on that trip? I think our entire team is really excited to get out there and compete. This national competition is what we've been training for all year, and it's going to be a long day, but we've traveled long days before, and we've prepared for it, so we're just ready to go. Little different setup. Up till now, you've been worried about your scores, uh, team score. This time, though, uh, there are four teams in your session, and you need to be in the top two to advance. Yes. Uh, how does that change the way you guys compete? It does not really change how we compete. It changes our mentality behind it. We go out there, and we want to hit the best teams we can. We want to hit three teams that we do in practice every day, and just come out on top and ready to go and with the confidence that we will be qualifying at team finals. Your team, other than the freshmen, have experience have been to the last couple championship meets. How will that help you? That will help us a lot. I remember being a freshman, freshman myself and the seniors would talk about nationals and I didn't quite understand everything but now that I've been there and almost all of our team has been there before and seen everything. It just gives you an edge. You know what to expect. You know what the pressure will be and you know how the team wants to perform. So that's good. After Thursday, which is a session, hopefully you advance to Friday's team finals. And Saturday's a little different. It's all about the individual yes. and events. Um, your thoughts on that if you're fortunate enough to qualify for individual event finals? Event finals is pretty much icing on the cake. The team comes first and if we can, after you have that first night qualifying to team finals and then the event finals is just the topper to it all. If you're qualified to that, it's what you've been working for in yourself, but it comes after the team. And just lastly, can we comment just on your, your career at SPU and what maybe you've uh, viewed as the highlight of your career? I would say the highlight would probably be either breaking the school record on being our sophomore year at conference and it was at home or just qualifying to nationals last year and everything that came from that. But the experiences here have been the best four years I could have asked for and they went by faster than I could have ever imagined and it's definitely going to be a big void in my life after but I'll always have the family here. And what are your plans after this year? After this year, I will graduate, but then I will come back to finish my degree completely, and then we will see what happens from there. Great. Thanks very much, and good luck. Thank you.